Welcome back everybody, my name is Eltamar and we are going to be continuing our let's play of Legend of Grimrock 2. Uh, where we left off last time, we had just entered the pyramid, we've explored a little bit of it, just this area here and here, and now we're just uh, standing near a hole to fall down, which I don't want to do. Maybe I do, I don't actually know. I'm sure I'll find out. Oh god, that hurt. Or it didn't hurt, actually. We just have to move really quickly. Ha! I hear something opening. But I'm not sure what it was, so... Let's uh, not worry about it just yet. Hey, a tomb key. Very nice. Well, we found a tomb key. Excellent. And, uh, yeah, let's have ourselves a meander. See, Dead End Hallways creep me out in that it seems like there should be, you know, something you can do to them. I'm not seeing any buttons or anything. Hmm. Okay, let's have a quick meander over here one more time. I just wanted to make sure, because like, normally these long hallways with nothing in them should really have something in them. Maybe I have to do it again? See, now something sounds like it closed. Like a right here somewhere. Or possibly opened. Ah, so there is a secret there. Now the better question is, how do we get to it without... Okay, so we have to like... Hmm... I don't know if I can move fast enough to make it there on time. Oops. Well, we fell into the dungeon, so um, let's see what's down here, I guess. Snake. I need some healing potions. And an antidote potion. Whatever. Give one to her, one, or two to her, and one to him. Uh, do I have an antidote potion kicking around? Probably. Yes, I do. And it's very dark in here. Let's quickly, uh... Where are we? We're in the tomb underground, apparently. The way back up. Well, let's go exploring. Hello, snake. There's some sort of door there. It looks like a torch sconce. But I don't think I have any torches because I never bothered to carry them around with me. I bet I need a torch for that. Yeah, that seems about right. Okay, so let's continue onwards. Let's find our way out of here. Or at least find a torch. One of the two. 
there's another barrier here. No buttons or anything though. Hmm, I'm guessing these are secrets we'll probably have to figure out at some point in time. That yeah, we'll figure it out later. I just want to figure out the, uh... I really want a torch now. So let's go find a torch. Wasn't there a torch on the ground somewhere? Was that in another part of this dungeon? I thought for sure I saw a torch on the ground somewhere. That just seems like it should be the thing we do. Whether or not it is. Oh, there's a torch. Let's get take that one. Encumbered by a torch. That's just sad. Alright, skills. Um, let's go with... He's got full crit. Let's go with accuracy. Make sure he hits every strike. And why are you encumbered by a torch? You're a rat. You should be able to carry a ton of things. Okay. I wish there was like a feather fall or something. Because I have a feeling I'm going to break my feet again. Is there a feather fall spell? Light, darkness, ice shards, shock shield, force field, shield, shock, poison, fireball, fire burst, lightning. So the answer to that is no. At least not that I have yet anyways. All right, well, let's make some new healing potions. We need to find some more uh, mushrooms running out. Hey, no one broke their feet this time. Cool. Whether or not this actually works, I, I don't have any idea. We'll find out really quickly though. Ah, totally does. Speed potion. Maybe I have to use speed potion and run really fast. Thank you for the torch that I don't need. Um, what am I carting around that weighs so much? There we go. Don't really need throwing knives. I got shurikens and stuff like that. Now, does the speed potion make us run faster or just attack faster? Because if it makes us run faster, we might be able to make it. idea how I'm supposed to do that. Unless there's like a pressure plate or something on the other side that I can throw something into. Okay, let's quick save and see what a speed potion does. It just makes him attack faster. Damn. I had a momentary hope that I would be cruising along. Or that works, just like that. Ha! Excellent! That worked great! So we got some Mirror Greaves, Protection and Resistance. I'm going to give that to our Minotaur, I think. What is he wearing, exactly? Embalmer shoes. They're not great, but they are better slightly, I think, than hers. Encumbered, of course. Um, what can I get rid of? I think weighs quite a bit. So does this. Oh, hey, she's got mushrooms. Give those to him. And now she can put these in there, along with this and that. And that. Why am I carting that around still? There we go. That's a little bit better. 
Inventory cleared up a little bit. Weapons can go in here. Including the pickaxe. I don't know why. But just in case I need them. Maybe I should throw them all in the hub. I'm willing to bet that that would be a good place to throw it all. That way if I ever need it, I can find it. Now... I'm not really sure what the point of that whole side of this thing was for, like... How do we do this? What is this? I guess we haven't done this side yet. Okay, let's uh, try this one out again. So we have the crystal, there was a door... Can't open. If I came down this way, there was a bunch of tombs I couldn't open. Hmm. Maybe. It's simpler than I'm anticipating. Nope. All right. the key of the door. Wait a minute, I have a tomb key. What is that for? Okay, let's go um, back out and see if we can find a place to put this key. Because maybe it's one of those places up there. Uh, how do I get out of here? Straight down, take a left, take another left. Nope. Straight, straight, take a right. And then make our way this way. Right, we can't go any further, but there are some areas back here. Let's try one of them out. Oh shit. We're in a new area. A new tomb area full of tombs. Lots of tombs. Alright, um, well, I mean, we fell in, so we might as well try and find a way out. Yet another torch. Um,. Is this similar to the other place where we had to uh, press a button to make the teleporter go away for a minute? Because... The only reason I say that is because that hallway looks like it extends further on. Or maybe I had to fall down a different hole to get there. That is a possibility as well. I guess we're stuck here for now. Okay, let's just leave. Okay, let's put one rock there so we don't fall to our death. Now we can't see anything. What if I throw one over there? Ha! Beautiful. Okay, what is the point of this room? Oh. I believe that would be the point of this room. What did it open though? I don't know. 
Maybe something in the other tomb? We already did that one. Let's try this one. Did it open a door or something? Well, not that door if it opened one. And not that door. Nor any of the cages. Alright. Hmm. This is Trixie. I'm guessing I had to hit both of those buttons for something to open up, and I can't get into that one yet, so... Or... Did one of these open up? Negative. What was this recipe for? I hear things walking around. Okay, um, is there another button in here on the other side? Just the one, eh? Maybe you got rid of the teleporter downstairs? Eh, why not check? Nope, that is still definitely there. What if these change based on what we have down? Hang on, let's try something. Okay, so for right now, the first... It's closed, open, closed. Aha! So now it's closed, open, open. I think each of these is half of the puzzle. So if we go back to this room, does it mirror that one? If I'm looking this way. Yes, it does. Okay. That's not what I meant to do. I blame myself for that. As I should. There we go, whatever. But that's all I needed to do. So two of them are open now. Oh, it's timed. Oh, so I have to make it a very specific path. Which actually works right now, because I would need to close that one, that one, that one, that one. And I'm guessing there's one over there somewhere. Okay, good enough. Question is, how do I do this other side of the thing? But we're at 20 minutes, so uh, we're going to go try and figure that out in the next video. There's got to be something to do with these doors, so... Like always, if you have any suggestions or comments, please leave them below. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next video.